Hello everyone! In this video, we're going to explain radiation using examples from War Thunder. Let's get started. What is radiation? Radiation is the process by which energy is emitted and transferred in the form of particles or waves. It can travel through space or a material medium and comes from both natural and artificial sources. There are different types of radiation, but one of the most important is radioactive radiation, which occurs when an unstable atom releases energy or particles to become stable. To better understand this, let's use an example in War Thunder. Now, imagine a T-72 tank equipped with ERA. In our analogy, the T-72 itself represents the nucleus of an unstable atom. The ERA represents extra energy or unstable particles in the atom. For an atom to be unstable, it must have too many neutrons. In our analogy, this would be like the T-72 having an excessive amount of ERA plates attached to it, more than necessary. An unstable atom wants to get rid of excess energy to become stable. Similarly, our T-72 needs to shed some of its extra ERA plates to return to a more balanced state. Now, imagine that a powerful explosion near the T-72 causes some of its ERA panels to fly off. This is a great example of how an unstable atom releases particles and energy to stabilize. The ERA flying off represents radiation being emitted from the atom. The energy released in this process is what we call radioactive radiation. Radiation can be classified in different ways depending on its origin and energy level. The main categories are natural and artificial radiation. Natural comes from the sun, cosmic rays, and radioactive elements in the earth. Artificial comes from nuclear reactors, X-rays, and human-made sources. Ionizing and non-ionizing radiation. Ionizing radiation has enough energy to remove electrons from atoms, which can cause serious damage to living tissue. This includes alpha, beta, and gamma radiation. Non-ionizing radiation does not have enough energy to remove electrons, but it can still transfer heat or cause molecular changes. Examples include radio waves, microwaves, and infrared radiation. I will explain these types of radiation in more detail in a future video. In summary, in simple terms, radiation is the emission of energy or particles from an unstable atom trying to become stable. We can visualize this with a T72 overloaded with ERA, where the ERA represents excess energy or particles that the atom needs to get rid of. When these ERA plates fly off, it symbolizes how an unstable atom emits radiation to stabilize itself. This process happens in nature all the time, whether in radioactive elements, nuclear reactions, or even inside the sun. This is just the first part of our radiation series. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button, subscribe for more, and let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.